Hey everybody, I'm Ivonix and this is Human. It's a new indie horror game and I thought I would check it out. So this is the starting screen, it just kind of puts you right into it. Um, we're apparently at a Dot .onion website looking at a video here and it, so let's see, it says, The following footage was captured during an attempt to hack and record a government video stream. Previously captured footage footage suggests the man filming, Paul, works for a secret sector of frequency testing facility located deep in the Alaskan wilderness. The program is no longer being funded, thus Paul is sent to notify the employees and have them leave the premises as his supervisors monitor what unfolds once he arrives. I've taken the liberty of submitting, of subtitling the video, but other than that, this footage is completely undoctored. All right, let's see what, let's see what's on this, uh, this footage. Okay, so I apparently take on the role of uh, Paul in this video. That voice was really hard to understand, it's so staticky. Okay, at least I can run. Okay, so I have to turn off the power supply before I leave. I should not forget that. God, we're just out in the wilderness. Nothing around for miles except this one building here. Let's see what happens. Woo! Okay. Whoa. Alrighty. Got some walkers. Is anybody home? Good thing I've got a flashlight. Wouldn't be able to see shit otherwise. Wow. They give you a little light, but you know, it's not very generous. I'll keep the flashlight on for now. What's that sound? Intercom. Can I... some sort? General radio? Okay, apparently I can't use that. Let's see what's through this door over here. Zeta, ca Zeta sector keycard required. Don't have that. Hello? Is anybody in this... Utility closet. Monsters around the corner. Whoa. Okay. Mouse is pretty sensitive, so I almost got turned around there. What is this on the floor? Right mouse button to zoom. Can I, can I read that? Oh, it's a tablet! It says, Notes, although our focus in the past few years has been primarily in auroral research, we have observed a notable difference in climate since our research began nearly a decade ago. Due to our experimentation, we cannot say our antennas are capable of controlling climate or weather, but they certainly have the ability to influence changes in the ionosphere, thus modifying the weather patterns slightly. I'd also like this particular research log to note in the past few weeks, the frequency output has been much higher, suggesting an atmospheric source is wirelessly feeding power to them. At the moment, we have not yet identified the source. Oh, great. Whoa, hey, I can see myself. But how am I holding the camera? Is it attached to my, to my head? There's another... These radios. Hey, is that the Zeta Sector keycard? Yes. Excellent. Oh, why? Is that a monster or some shit that was making that noise? Or is that just creepy ambience? Just there to spook me. I mean, why are all these desks barricaded around this hallway and around that door? That is the question I am asking myself. Uh... Okay, well, dead end. Gotta get back. 
so I can go to the Zeta Sector. What? That wasn't like that before. Someone's been playing with the lockers. Why on earth would someone do that? Hey! Someone talking over that? I thought I heard a voice. Oh no. Alright. I'm ready to be spooked. What? Great! Oh, okay. Where am I now? What just happened? Let me leave! Okay. I can't go back. Don't ignore me. Who are you? I want to talk to you, buddy. Oh, everybody hung themselves. Well, so much for uh, having to tell everybody they need to leave. I guess that part of the job is uh, done for me. Who's there? Or is that just the sound of the bodies swaying on the ropes? Well, if the equipment's gonna be moved out next week, and everybody's dead, can't I just- I, well, I was about to say, can't I just leave? But then I remembered, oh yeah, it won't let me leave. Creepy, okay, how- all right, whoa. That is a little too close. Okay. All of our equipment has recently been turning off all at once as though there were a power surge. However, when the event occurs, nothing unusual seems to be the cause. On a side note, we have been experiencing frequency interference in recent weeks. This has caused us to slow down research efforts, as we have no control over experimentation when this happens. Using one of our spect spectrograms, we have recorded an odd signal which we believe to be the source of the interference. Some of us suspect it could be Russian, others think it may just be excessive ambient energy. This doesn't explain where it's coming from, however. Oh, dear. Oh, frozen screen. Does it actually say anything? Uh, it's just gibberish. Who's there? I'll take your word for it. Um, okay. Nothing on that. Just more frozen screens. Blue screen of death. Yep. <laughs> Problem has been detected and Windows has shut down. Alright, can't go through that door. Gotta go upstairs. Huh. More bodies? Okay. Why is it there just like this dark patch here? I don't like there's anybody in there. I guess I can keep moving. <laughs> Crap! The sounds was the sound freaking got me more than anything. It's like what the hell? Oh, there's a door at that end and nothing at that end. But the shadow was going this way. Let's check out the door for first. Thanks for the shortcut. Data sector key card required. Okay. Gotta go the way the spooky, spooky shadow went. Hey, blood. I look forward to that. 
Yay, blood in the pipes. I think, therefore, I am. Yes, I'm sure. Round another corner. Whoop! Okay. Anytime I look all like directly down the hallway, it goes. Oh, it stopped. Oh, no, no. Okay, is it anytime I move forward? I don't know. Don't know why it keeps doing that, but it does. What is all this? Oh, and it's red when I walk up to it. And now it's gone. Or am I even in the same room? I don't think I'm even in the same room. What's this? What does it say in here? Notes, this frequency interference continues. We have not done any work for the past four days. No one has left. For some reason, I feel as though we're drawn to this place. We must stay. Sleep has been difficult. Our sanity seems to be slipping. I feel numb yet cold. I feel I know less than I once did. My memories, my knowledge, my intelligence. What is this? Beats the hell out of me. Maybe I'll find out. Or die. Both are very, very possible at this point. Oh, okay. All right. So I went that's I went in through that door. It sounds like there's another speaker on the other side of here. Got anything to say? Living lie. Alpha sector keycard acquired. Okay, all right. What is this? Uh, I'm unsure of what's real. I'm going to upload this to our closed network as we've been instructed so you may read it. I see no point, however. No research has been done. We are waiting. We can't leave. Why can't we leave? I try and try. The door never gets any closer. This can't be real. This is not reality. I don't know if I'm hallucinating. It says there's another world. Yay! Oh, those ones have been wiped clean. Hey, Tesla! Nikola Tesla. That's a nice little cameo. All right, more more spooky shadows. No. Why would you put me back here? Didn't I need the a different key card to go through that other door? At least I thought I did. Oh, here we go. Interesting. It's just a little disorienting the way you, uh, they have you travel around the map. Sector key card acquired. That's what I just picked up. Oh boy. What surprises await me in this room? Someone moving furniture around? Any... Ah, there's another tablet. And another keycard that's probably the, what is it, Theta? Yep, Theta Sector. All right, what does this one say? A door, it's a door we've opened. The frequency, it communicates with us. We brought it here and you knew it was going to happen. We can't leave because it's not let us leave. You knew this would happen. It's a portal, takes your mind, not mine anymore. Great. Another blue screen of death. Guess I gotta go back to that Theta door. <laughs> God damn, so loud. Run through the dripping blood. Thank you. That's a lot of blood. Just keeps building and building. I 
Well. Oh boy, I hope I endure. It'd be nice to be immortal. Oh, it's getting louder. Hello? Am I in the Matrix? Is that what you're saying? Oh, what, what lies in the darkness ahead? A single light! and pentagrams and what have you on the floor. What does this say? It feeds. Came from my soul. Our soul. Soul is not safe. Any soul, all soul. Great! If I stand in the glyph, will I die? No. They're just there for show. Oh, hey. Oh, wait. Everywhere else in the room is blocked off, so... If I stand here, what do I do? do I to, oh, okay. Alright, I just have to look at them and walk... Walk towards them and I teleport. Alright, that was the wrong way, apparently. I'm guessing this is a little maze thing. So would I go this way? There we go. Now I'm on this one. Okay, that's not a way. That's not a way. Run back this way. Nope, that just led me back there. Aha! I'm getting closer. Oh, I need- okay. Didn't see that exit. Here? Nope! Okay. That way doesn't work. This way, this way. Ye yep, here we are. Exit! Oh boy, there's there's one more tablet. One more tablet. What does it say? All souls say goodbye. Goodbye. Up the stairs we go to our doom. Oh. What the fuck? Fascinating! Oh, is, is that... It's an inverted pentagram up ahead? Am I descending into hell? Run towards our doom! So Sounds good to me! Hi, Satan! <laughs> Satan all along. Well, that was awesome. Uh, my only complaint would be that the it's like the voiceover was a little too distorted, and then the subtitles were a little too small. Um, but other than that, yeah, I, I I really enjoyed that. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. I'll put a link to the game in the description below. So yeah, go check it out. That was human. Um, and for now, thanks for watching. And until next time, rock on.